very much for being here. I know the gentlemen are going to get their pins on. I want you to take a good look at it. Uh, the pin, by the way, is uh, has the claim of the province of Ontario. It also has the crown, representing the uh, vice regal office, and of course, Your Majesty the Queen. And the uh, symbol at the bottom is part of from my uh, coat of arms, which is a symbol of the phoenix, the phoenix rising. So it has a great deal of symbolism. And uh, gentlemen, please wear it in good health, both of you. And so, ladies and gentlemen, uh, what a privilege it is to be here today. And uh, as the representative of Her Majesty the Queen in the province of Ontario, I thank you for being here and enjoy the rest of the day. Thank you. Excuse me. I would like to welcome the Honourable David Tilson, our Member of Parliament, to say a few words. Good afternoon, everyone. Uh, Warden Hill, Mayor Croson, Your Honour. Uh, it's a pleasure to be with, your, be with you here today to celebrate the 150th anniversary of the founding of, of Shelburne. And I'd like to thank uh, Mayor Croson and Deputy Mayor uh, Bennington for inviting me and hosting this event. It's important that we mark the passage of time and remember those responsible for getting us where we are today. As a product of his land purchase 150 years ago, as well as his immense commitment, commitment to building a great town, William Jelly set the foundation for this wonderful community we now know as Shelburne. As the first businessman, first postmaster, and first read, and your worship, a fellow conservative, <laughs> William Jelly not only developed this area, but he also represented Dufferin in the Legislative Assembly of Ontario from 1879 to 1883. I personally lived beside Mr. Jelly's descendants for 20 years on York Street in Orangeville, and living that close to his ancestors is truly noteworthy. I'd like to thank Kane Sibley, the artist behind this wonderful statue of Shelburne's founder, which we're, we're about to see soon. Your talent is playing an important role in making history. Shelburne is filled with vast character, charm, and is the home to many great people, as the highly anticipated Shelburne Fiddlefest. It's most appropriate that we should honor this great pioneer who devoted his life efforts to developing Shelburne, as without him, we wouldn't be here today. And we wouldn't have the many great things that this town has to offer. This statue will be a lasting tribute to honor William Jelly's legacy and the immense contribution he made to the town of Orangeville. Thank you very much, ladies and gentlemen.